So if you plan to write a book in this upcoming year, then here are a couple of tips that you need to know to further position yourself to become the author that you desire to be or become the author again that you desire to be for 2019. First of all, you need to select the topic that not only that you love and know a lot about, but that you know people absolutely positively want to read about because it's something that they need. It's something that they crave on the inside, right? The second thing that you need to do is start asking for support and start asking for help now, right? If you find yourself procrastinating in the process, which is easy to do, you find yourself stuck, ask somebody you know who's already an author, hire you a book coach, get the support you need so that you can give birth to what God has placed inside of you during this next year of your life. The second thing, the third thing that you need to do is start attracting people to your book now. Do not wait until you publish your book and it's in your hand before you're like, oh, let me market this. Oh, let me put this out. No, you need to start creating a plan of attack now that is going to position you to start attracting people your way when it comes to your book, but also when it comes to your brand. The fourth thing that you need to focus on is what am I going to do beyond the book? If you want to be paid to write, if you want to be paid to speak or to teach, because a lot of people who write, they oftentimes become speakers or they're naturally a teacher because they're teaching or they're sharing or they're empowering. So what is going to, what are you going to do beyond the book? Is there going to be a program? Do people get free book bonuses um, once they have um, gotten your book, right? Is there going to be a book tour after where you're going to different, you know, local cities and you're meeting with people and connecting? Is there a way you're collecting email addresses? You know, again, is there a program that's attached to it, a live one or an offline one? Is there going to be a sequel to the book? So, What's going to be the next step? Is it a video series connected to it? So I want you to go beyond just, I'm going to be writing a book. I want you to get into a space and a place where you know that you're anointed, you're qualified, you're chosen, you're called, you're gifted. So people are going to want you beyond just this little book. They want more of you, right? And God requires more of you. So what are you going to produce? What are you going to publish? beyond just your book that is going to let the people that you have been called to serve know, right, that you got their back, that your story is the story that you needed to tell because it's going to set somebody else free. It's going to help somebody else become all of who God has called them to be. Why is everybody rushing out to get becoming by Michelle Obama? Because we see what she's become, which is a beautiful thing. But beyond that, I'm sure there are going to be so many other products and services to come beyond that. The tour that she's doing is just the beginning. There's more coming behind this billion dollar brand that she's building. And I know everybody is not the first lady of the United States or the former first lady. She's still my first lady of the United States. But you are the first lady in your own kingdom. You are the first lady in your own queendom. So what stage are you going to set? What brand are you going to build from the book, right? Or from the event or from the program or from the product that you're going to put out next year? Go beyond just that thing. Think bigger. Step outside of the box. Boss up. Okay, it's time for you to go to your next level. So I hope these tips have been helpful. Let me know in the comments um, if something resonated with you and let me know if I can further help support you in this journey as we move into this next year.